A New Year's Eve shooting kills two teens in Joliet, and the scary incident has residents living near the crime scene concerned. Here's CBS 2's My Martinez. You can still see the fresh holes right there on there. Those holes caused by a barrage of bullets fired outside Janice Hudson's Joliet home while she and her four kids were inside about to ring in the new year. I heard like 20 gunshots. When we heard the gunshots, we immediately hit the floor. We didn't know if it was just celebration or what was going on. According to Joliet police, what was going on was an assault rifle attack on a car in the 900 block of Rosalind. A woman inside the car told police two people approached the vehicle and the driver tried to drive off, but then someone opened fire on the car, hitting it at least 12 times, with bullets striking two of the five people inside, a 17-year-old girl and a 15-year-old boy. Latrice Reeves and her son, Jay Sean, also heard the shots and took cover. First few that I heard, I grabbed my kids and to the floor, yeah. away from the window. Boom, boom. <laughs> and it just didn't stop? No. Continuous bow bow, maybe. The brain was maybe. messed up. Police say the driver drove the victims here to Silver Cross Hospital in New Lenox, where both died a short time later. Those living near the scene say it's a miracle no one else died. I mean, when you see that there's a bullet right over your window, knowing you and your kids were inside. Yes, exactly. It's scary. It's terrifying. I say I'm blessed every day because one of them bullets could have easily hit one of my kids. In Joliet, my Martinez, CBS 2 News. The three other people in the car were not injured. At this time, police do not know if the shooting was gang related. If you have any information, you're asked to call investigators.